I'm not just going to breathe into the microphone the whole time. <laughs> I'm going to do it for a little bit more. You should keep paying attention to me, even though you, I told you what I'm going to do for a little bit longer. Keep paying attention. I didn't want to tell you what to do, but I think uh, if you keep paying attention, you'll be glad that you did. I'm sorry that the, the pace of this has remained uh, relatively the same. I'm not sure if it's going to change or not. Like the, this, the pacing of when I say things and how much breathing there is between saying things. So that means um, there's something for you to pay attention and look out for because you don't know what's going to happen. You're going to come and talk faster or more or stay the same. So that means there's some tension being held in it. So now I, I don't have to remind you to keep paying attention. You also feel okay.
you feel okay right now? Like I said earlier, that I'm not sure that I'm, whether I'm talking in a relaxed conversational tone or whether I'm talking in a very controlled tone. I'm also not sure um, if I'm trying to break the fourth wall by addressing the audience. Because uh, I'm not sure if I put up the fourth wall to begin with. But you, I do have a microphone um, and also there's more light shining on me and um, almost everybody here is looking at me and I'm pretty sure most everyone here is paying attention to me. I can feel it. You might be wondering if I'm repressing the urge to laugh uh, or to smile when other people laugh or smile. <clears throat> um, for now, that's just going to remain one of the mysteries. Uh, <laughs> Some people uh, want to remove the physical gesture um, from what they're doing to make it make make it more pure. I'm going to make a gesture soon. So. Uh, pay attention to see the gesture. Yeah. Keep paying attention, um, even if this seems like it's starting to drag. Uh, okay. Or also, uh, look for, look, pay close attention for when it seems like the tension in the room is waning, and it seems like people are losing their attention. Because uh, that might be part of it. Uh, and so you should pay attention for that. And uh, it should be okay, and you can continue to feel okay if that happens. And I will also try to feel, continue to feel okay if that happens. If if the attention starts to wane and I feel like people aren't paying attention to me or uh, or if I if uh, something happens where I started to feel like this was I was doing a bad job at performing <clears throat> um, but I, ha I have to admit if that did happen if I felt like I was doing a bad job right now I would uh, it would pretty much preclude uh, feeling okay about it. It would mean that I didn't feel okay. But uh, I do still feel okay about this, and um, I imagine that uh, you also feel okay about this. And <clears throat> at some point, I'm going to tell you some information about how you can continue to feel okay uh, for as long as possible. That's going to happen a little bit later.
I'm going to try and do my best not to act out learned emotions in front of you or have a particular emotion that I want to achieve uh, while performing. And I'm going to try and not use you as a sort of dumping ground for unprocessed emotions. I'm really, I'm very grateful for your attention. Although I, I don't think that I'm uh, creating fourth wall and it also seems like I'm trying to do something that's uh, anti-spectacle. Uh, I also recognize that every, there's a lot of people paying attention to me right now, which is a lot different than, than uh, most of my life. And so I, I feel like I should behave in accordance, I should behave a little bit different than I would in uh, daily life. Um, uh, I, right now I, I feel just uh, really, really okay. Uh, and I feel I was, I was going to say that I feel different than normal life, um, but then I, I thought then I thought it wasn't true, and I was just so I was going to say I, I feel pretty much the same as how I normally feel when when uh, not performing. Uh, then as, as I started to say those things, and or, well, I, I I felt the thoughts forming like before uh, my mouth started moving and. Uh, as that happened, I started to feel different. Uh, and as, as I said, the, those things just now, I also started to feel different. So like right now, I'm, I'm feeling increasingly uh, different than I normally feel. But as I just said that, it didn't feel really true. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm not sure now. Um, I, I definitely still feel okay, and I, I'm pretty confident that I will continue to feel okay for the rest of this. So I, I'm, uh, I, I feel like I can't fail at this. Um, which, would, which would seem to imply that there might not be any tension to be held here uh, with this performance, it, it seems like I can't fail. In which case it would be kind of a failure. But as I said earlier, uh, if we do experience this thing where the attention starts to lag, then uh, I, I told you to pay attention for that and look out for that. And if that happens, just remember that it's okay. And uh, you can, I'm starting to gesticulate a little more, uh, which can can kind of be like this visual indicator of something that I'm, I'm like really uh, into what I'm doing or something. Uh, I'm feeling it. Um, I think it's pretty obvious right now that I, I don't feel like there's a, a hierarchical power dynamic between us that should be abolished. Like I, don't, uh, I, don't, I don't feel like I need, need to break the fourth wall. I, I, feel like, I don't feel like I need to uh, liberate the audience from their passive roles as spectators because uh, I just uh, kind of, I already trust you that you're, you, you feel confident enough in yourself that you can stop paying attention to me or stop watching if you want and you can uh, do whatever. But I also appreciate that you are paying attention to me and uh, it's, it's creating this sort of exalted moment. I feel like this is exalted. This is, this is the first time I've smiled. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, so, 
this this would uh, that is kind of evidence that this is more conversational uh, and casual, and I'm I'm less controlled now emotionally. It seems like um, my, I've broken my composure. Um, so this is this was going to make it a little bit uh, harder to uh, make that division. I got the end of the performance where at the end of the performance I would usually break my composure and seem relaxed and conversational. And so would you, uh, but since I, I don't feel like I'm building up uh, that uh, tension and I, I'm, I'm like not holding my composure completely for this um, this uh, thing that. Uh, it might kind of just like uh, fade in to to the not performance to the end of it. Um, <clears throat> uh, so That was, that was a, a silence to help liberate the audience from the spectacle, and so you can uh, pay attention to the, how uh, wonderful the moment is when, without the performance, like uh, with how the sounds themselves are, the act of listening is the music, uh, the act of watching is the performance. Uh, that's not, not really, I was, I was just like... <laughs> uh, so, I, I, I promised you earlier that I would give you some information about how to feel okay, or how to, how to continue feeling okay. We already feel okay right now, um, and so how are we going to continue feeling okay uh, for as long as possible? Um, well, I, I had something prepared for that. Um, it doesn't, but now it doesn't seem to make as much sense um, following what I was, what I just said, and what's happening right now. Um, I'm, I was, I'm trying to think of it. I, I was, I was going to try and remember what I was going to say about that, uh, but I realized that it would, it would take, it would. It would take my attention away from what I'm saying right now, uh, and I'd, I guess that'd be okay. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop paying attention to what I'm saying right now, and then I'm gonna re remember what I was gonna say about how to continue feeling okay. Okay, so if, if, if indeed we feel like this is an exalted state right now, uh, or, or if we feel like, if we feel like this is a performance, and if we feel like, if we feel okay because, because this is a performance, or if this performance is helping you feel okay, uh, then we can we can uh, we can say that the performance will continue uh, af after it seems like it's ended. Um, so I, I was gonna I was gonna do something like I was gonna ask for our audience participation, where the the audience would participate. Uh, on I acting with me like the performance had ended, um, and by doing that, uh, it would continue the performance and continue the feeling of okay, of okayness, um, because we've associated feeling okay with the performance. Uh, but now, as I'm saying it, it feels. Uh, 
I don't, I don't, it doesn't feel, I f it feels less genuine and uh, I feel, I started to feel, no, I, I almost started to feel afraid that uh, something bad was happening, but uh, I'm just going to try and uh, go through, uh, push through it. <clears throat> Uh, I can feel, I think I can feel my heart beating. I'm just gonna, it seems like it wouldn't be a bad time to just breathe in the microphone for a little bit more.
I mean, it might be kind of abrupt or something, or like this might not seem like a natural thing. But I'm just gonna, I'm gonna walk like through over there. There's a path right there, and then it'll be over. Doing. <laughs> 